Okay. Hello there YouTube, Zach Moss here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an ammonite. In case you're wondering what an ammonite is, try to picture a squid or any other cephalopod animal like an octopus or a cuttlefish but with a shell kind of like this one only a bit more round and bigger and I mean like big enough to sit on a kitchen table the reason why they're called ammonites is because their shells resembled ram horns horns and when Pliny the Elder discovered them he named them after the Egyptian ram god and Amun. So there's a bit of ancient Greek history and some ancient Egyptian mythology. Now, you can just use one of these to make your very own ammonite. Right? A cute little seashell. Well, you can find these at any, any store that sells after arts and crafts items like Walmart or a dollar store. And I'm going to see about using two bended pipe cleaners. Now, I'm not really good at this. This is my third video. I mean, fourth video. I'm sorry. Now, let's get started, should we? Me? Oh, but first, I'm going to angle this, this a little better and... I'd say this is better. Now, here's what you do with your banded uh, pipe cleaner. You just bend it like so, you just bend it in half like this. Have already the end from tip to tip. Then you do this process again. So the bend is right along with the other two tips. Let me see something. No, no, I probably don't want to. I might mess up the video. Then you just bend these. These like so. Till you get two little tentacles. You do this with the other one like so. Let me show you and mm. voila! It looks kind of like something you'd find as a flower. But you take this little bit right here and just twist, just twist and twist till it looks kind of like a little flower. You do the same thing with another bent pipe cleaner. Well, let me see if I can get you guys to see this properly. Then you just twist this as well. Now you have two little flowers. Then you just twist the little, little stems right here together right, until it forms something that looks kind of like a flower or, in this case, a, a squid or an octopus. Then all you guys need to do is just put this in here so it can actually stay in there. And then, ta-da! Let me see if I can you know, do this sort of thing. Just make the tentacles holes all spread out so you can actually see the little, what you made. And presto! You got yourself a little ammonite. Here it is 
is on the C floor. And here it is. The one was on. Here it is as it is sleeping. You can also do this to. If you want, you can take two of these, two of these tentacles, make them into eyes, and make the rest into little legs to make a little hermit crab. So I just showed you how to make a little hermit crab and a, and a little ammonite. And trust me guys, this is easier than you would think. Well, I hope you enjoyed. Please leave comments down below. And I'll see you guys.